Van Winkle's birthday! You wanted to see me? Chris, I didn't hear you come in. I was just working on something. You said you wanted to show me something. Yes, sir. It's a lean cuisine box. Not that. Are you serious? Deadly serious. As a heart attack. My life has not been very good since the loss in the playoffs. My life is in shambles. I had to sell my house just to keep the team. And I think I've contracted hepatitis C. I also live in a dumpster. Smut dogs. The playoffs? To be honest, I haven't thought about it since the last game. Uh, I'm doing fine, though. I'm really happy. I'm in a really good place. And uh, I don't feel responsible for how the season ended. Uh, it was a team effort. And what good is a game if it's not fun, right? And, I mean, it's just 0-5. It's just 0-5. We didn't win a single game. I'm fine. I'm fine. After the playoffs, I uh, had to do a little soul searching. I decided to uh, join in with the RCAA, the Recovering Crack Addicts of America. And with them, I go around the country. Uh, right now, I'm in the area that the police call the thicket. I'm helping a recovering crack addict named Mindy. And uh, what I do is I go around and do free landscaping for them. Uh, you don't get any money, it's all volunteer work. <laughs> well, I get paid in smiles. <laughs> Am I upset about how the playoffs went? Of course, I'm human. But I moved on. Uh, I decided to take in my father's footsteps and uh, I'm exploring my entrepreneurial spirit. Yeah, birds for rent. You see, you can pick up a bird for three hours, you get a bag of food, and you get a leash. That's right. We got married. <laughs> three months, twins. Oh, we are as happy as we could be. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, they're most likely mine. Right? Of course they are. <laughs> of course yeah. they are. Of course they are. And our sex life? Fantastic. Fantastic. So what if she might be busy with some other guys, some other nights? But it's fine. People need escorting, right? So after um, I finished my season with the Smut Dogs, that fulfilled all my community service hours. Um, but you know, I just decided it was time for a change. You know, a time to get my life back on track. So um, I read the Bible every day, uh, run a mile every morning. I met the woman I fell in love with. And we have three beautiful children, Matthew, Mark, and Luke. Little John's on the way. And you know, I just couldn't be more in love. <laughs> you shut We couldn't be happier. Gentlemen, please, can we keep it down? I've asked you all here today for a very secret, special meeting. I've decided to bring in my personal hero, former smut dog champion, Mr. Micah Figueroa. Would you please give him a round of applause? Mr. Micah Figueroa. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, gentlemen. Let me tell you, it is a, uh, it's a huge honor to be here. I, I'm glad to see you come back. And the SMU Smoke Doctor is still going strong. Five and oh. That is brilliant, guys. That is excellent. That's perfection. I gotta say, I'm very proud of you guys. This is, this is fantastic. I wanna say thank you. And I wanna say, uh, yeah. Donnie, question. We went 0 and 5. Shut up. Continue. What was that, son? 0 and 5. He means we lost 5 every game. and 0. 5 and 0. You lost every game? Yeah. Five losses in one season? Who's the captain? Chris. Chris. 
He's the captain? Yeah. I thought he had Down syndrome. Well, he did. Yeah, it's really confusing. Thank you, sir. Thank you for ruining everything. Mr. Micah Figueroa! <laughs> Alright, now let's not panic. Let's not panic. I've got a plan. Does anyone want to know what my idea is? No. What's your idea? Thank you. Two words. Softball. 